<clears throat> Back for more Hunger Games Simulator. This time I'm going to be playing it with classical composers. See which one of these composers is going to walk away as the winner. All right, shall we get started? I say we shall. Let's begin. As the tributes stand on their podiums, the horn sounds. Schubert scares Verdi away from the cornucopia. Haydn and Gershwin fight for a bag. Haydn gives up and retreats. Strauss runs away from the cornucopia. Bach takes a sickle from inside the cornucopia. Bizet grabs a backpack and retreats. Stravinsky snatches a bottle of alcohol and a rag. Tchaikovsky takes a spear from inside the cornucopia. Debussy runs away from the cornucopia. Mozart, Schumann, and Vivaldi work together to get as many supplies as possible. Beethoven attacks Chopin, but Handel protects him, killing Beethoven. Rossini spears Puccini in the abdomen. Mendelssohn shoots a poisonous blow dart into Brahms's neck, slowly killing him. Wagner runs away from the cornucopia. Liszt grabs a jar of fishing bait while Rachmaninoff gets fishing gear. Bernstein runs away from the cornucopia. <laughs> Schumann makes a slingshot. Rossini chases Stravinsky. Bizet tends to Vivaldi's wounds. Gershwin collects fruit from a tree. Schubert hunts for other tributes. Tchaikovsky forces Bernstein to kill Haydn or Mendelssohn. He decides to kill Mendelssohn. Handel sees smoke rising in the distance, but decides not to investigate. Liszt sprains his ankle while running away from Verdi. Strauss thinks about home. Bach explores the arena. Debussy overhears Rachmaninoff and Mozart talking in the distance. Chopin attacks Wagner, but he manages to escape. My goodness. Haydn receives an explosive from an unknown sponsor. Mozart begs for Verdi to kill him. He refuses, keeping Mozart alive. Gershwin thinks about winning. Schubert passes out from exhaustion. Handel receives an explosive from an unknown sponsor. Tchaikovsky screams for help. Schumann, Strauss, Vivaldi, and Bernstein tell each other ghost stories to lighten the mood. Bach, Wagner, Bizet, Debussy, and Chopin sleep in shifts. Rossini defeats Liszt in a fight, but spares his life. Stravinsky tracks down and kills Rachmaninoff. List hunts for other tributes. Bach decapitates Strauss with a sword. Handel attacks Vivaldi, but he manages to escape. Bizet, Chopin, and Wagner hunt for other tributes. Schubert constructs a shack. Haydn tries to spear fish with a trident. Tchaikovsky overhears Mozart and Bernstein talking in the distance. Debussy receives fresh food from an unknown sponsor. Gershwin defeats Schumann in a fight, but spares his life. Verdi bashes Stravinsky's head in with a mace. Rossini tries to sleep through the entire day. My goodness. Rossini is awoken by nightmares. Haydn begs for Schubert to kill him. He reluctantly obliges, killing Haydn. Bizet quietly hums. Tchaikovsky and Debussy run into each other and decide to truce for the night. Chopin fends Mozart, Wagner, and Liszt away from his fire. Handel attempts to start a fire, but is unsuccessful. Bernstein cries himself to sleep. <laughs> Verdi, Vivaldi, and Gershwin discuss the games and what might happen in the morning. Schumann destroys box supplies while he is asleep. Wagner hunts for other tributes. Handel accidentally detonates a landmine while trying to arm it. Rossini hunts for other tributes. Debussy receives an explosive from an unknown sponsor. Liszt tries to sleep through the entire day. Bizet, Bach, Tchaikovsky, and Bernstein hunt for other tributes. Verdi discovers a cave. Chopin overpowers Schumann, killing him. Mozart sees smoke rising in the distance, but decides not to investigate. Vivaldi tends to Gershwin's wounds. Schubert picks flowers. My goodness. Rossini and Bernstein run into each other and decide to truce for the night. Wagner climbs a tree to rest. Debussy is unable to start a fire and sleeps without warmth. Verdi stays awake all night. Schubert quietly hums. Bach, Gershwin, Liszt, and Mozart tell each other ghost stories to lighten the mood. Tchaikovsky, Vivaldi, and Bizet sleep in shifts. Chopin tries to sing himself to sleep.
Mozart is pricked by thorns while picking berries. Bizet discovers a river. Chopin tries to spear fish with a trident. Debussy searches for a water source. Rossini attacks Vivaldi, but he manages to escape. Bach is pricked by thorns while picking berries. Verdi constructs a shack. Wagner, Gershwin, Bernstein, and Tchaikovsky hunt for other tributes. Liszt sees smoke rising in the distance, but decides not to investigate. Schubert fishes. <laughs> Schubert and Chopin run into each other and decide to truce for the night. Bizet and Gershwin run into each other and decide to truce for the night. Tchaikovsky bashes Rossini's head against a rock several times. Debussy and Bernstein work together to drown Wagner. Liszt accidentally steps on a landmine. Mozart and Verdi run into each other and decide to truce for the night. Bach attempts to start a fire, but is unsuccessful. Vivaldi sets up camp for the night. Bernstein tends to Verdi's wounds. Gershwin tends to Chopin's wounds. Debussy practices his archery. Schubert spears Tchaikovsky in the abdomen. Mozart picks flowers. Vivaldi travels to higher ground. Bach receives an explosive from an unknown sponsor. Bizet collects fruit from a tree. Carnivorous squirrels start attacking the tributes. Verdi in agony kills Bernstein so he does not have to be attacked by the squirrels. Vivaldi survives. Gershwin is brutally attacked by a scurry of squirrels. The squirrels separate and kill Debussy and Chopin. Mozart survives. Schubert survives. Bizet survives. Bach survives. OMG. Schubert questions his sanity. Verdi lets Bach into his shelter. Mozart kills Vivaldi with a hatchet. Bizet is awoken by nightmares. The cornucopia is replenished with food, supplies, weapons, and memoirs from the tribute's families. Verdi decides not to go to the feast. Mozart decides not to go to the feast. Bach decides not to go to the feast. Bizet decides not to go to the feast. Schubert decides not to go to the feast. Oops. Mozart scares Schubert off. Bizet thinks about home. Verdi searches for firewood. Bach fishes. <clears throat> Bach tends to Bizet's wounds. Verdi, Mozart, and Schubert cheerfully sing songs together. Verdi tries to sleep through the entire day. Mozart and Bach work together to drown Bizet. Schubert discovers a river. OMG. Bach tries to sing himself to sleep. Verdi defeats Mozart in a fight, but spares his life. Schubert cooks his food before putting his fire out. Verdi, Mozart, Bach, and Schubert hunt for other tributes. My goodness. Schubert receives fresh food from an unknown sponsor. Mozart and Bach huddle for warmth. Verdi accidentally detonates a landmine while trying to arm it. Bach poisons Schubert's drink. He drinks it and dies. Mozart dies of dysentery. <laughs> the winner is Bach from District 2. Johann Sebastian Bach wins this simulation. <laughs> oh my goodness. Hmm. And wrap it up for this classical gameplay of Hunger Games Simulator, and I'll see you for the next one.